For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you. Now we are going to solve do this page number 294, chapter 11, trigonometry. If sin c is equal to 15 by 17, then find the cos c value. We already know that identity sin square c plus cos square c is equal to 1. Now we substitute sin c is equal to 15 by 17, then it can be written as 15 by 17 whole square plus cos square c is equal to 1. 15 square is 225, 17 square is 289. Now we transpose 225 by 289 from LHS to RHS then cos square c is written as 1 minus 225 by 289. Here LCM is 289. So we write 289 in denominator and numerator becomes 1 into 289, 289 and minus 225. After subtracting this we get 64 in numerator and the denominator is 289. Now cos c is written as square root of 64 by 289, 64 is written as 8 square and 289 is written as 17 square. Then after removing the square root, it can be written as 8 by 17, therefore cos c is equal to 8 by 17. Second weight, if tan x is equal to 5 by 12 is given, then find the secant x. We can find this by using the identity. 1 plus tan square x is equal to secant square x. Now we substitute the tan x value in this. Then it can be written as 1 plus 5 by 12 whole square is equal to secant square x. 5 square means 25 and 12 square means 144. Then it can be written as 1 plus 25 by 144 is equal to secant square x. Now denominator becomes 144 and the numerator becomes 144 plus 25. After adding 144 plus 25, we get 169 in numerator, denominator is 144. So it becomes 169 by 144 is equal to second square x. Now we take square root of 169 by 144 is equal to second x. 169 is written as 13 square, 144 is written as 12 square. After removing the square root, it can be written as 13 by 12 is equal to second x. Therefore, second x is equal to 13 by 12. Now we shall do this third bit. Page number 294, chapter 11, trigonometry. Here given, if cosecant theta is equal to 25 by 7, then find the cot theta. We can find the cot theta using the identity 1 plus cot square theta is equal to cosecant square theta. Now in this we substitute the cosecant theta is equal to 25 by 7, then it can be written as 1 plus cot square theta is equal to 25 by 7 whole square. 25 square is written as 625 and 7 square is written as 49. Now we transpose 1 from LHS to RHS then it can be written as cot square theta is equal to 625 by 49 minus 1. Now we take the LCM it can be 49 in denominator and in numerator it can be written as 625 minus 1 into 49 49. After Subtracting this, we get 576 in numerator and denominator is 49. Then we can write for cot square theta is equal to 576 by 49. Now we take cot theta is equal to square root of 576 by 49. 576 can be written as 24 whole square and 49 is written as 7 square. After removing the square root, it can be written as 24 by 7. Therefore, cot theta is equal to 24 by 7. Please like, share, subscribe our channel for latest updates by pressing the bell icon. For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you.